Hi, good evening, Corey Thorne. I was waiting for the words to leave the screen. <laughs> Corey Thorne, psychic medium, spiritual healer, and life coach, coming in to do the channel message for mid September. Sorry, I'm just getting in now, and you didn't get an early part of September, but you're going to be early on October. So, this is for mid September and all the way until the end of October that I'm doing for you. Um, and Taurus, I'm really picking up a sense that. Um, armored armored locked load protected like i just feel like you've been so so many of you've just been so overprotective overprotective and over guarding yourself closing off your heart and it's um tomorrow is the 19th i feel like the portal that was the portal that was gonna open on the um on the closer to the beginning of the month on the 9 9 i just feel like is it closes tomorrow and whatever of the past that you were kind of feeling like you need to guard yourself from, it's like it's going out, it's not coming in, and what is on this side of you is all, it's all a much better energy, and you get to finally take the, finally take off that guard, that that protection that you have been wearing. Please remember, I'm getting ahead of myself here. Please remember that this is a general message. This is not a channel. This is not. This is a channeled reading. This is not a personal reading. This is for the collective. It's for the general. It's very general. So if it doesn't resonate with you, then it's not for you this month. Um, also remember that this is not replace any medical, psych psychological advice that you've been given, and it's to be taken as a form of entertainment. You're free. You have free will and your own mind for a reason, and you also have your intuition. Uh, trust it. So I'm going into my mystical shaman cards for you because I feel like as this portal closes on the, the portal closes on the 19th, it's like you're walking into some unknown territory. It's been a long time since you've been on this side, and a long time since you've been feeling like you can feel safe for some of you, and it's like. Um, you have witnessed a lot, lot, you have seen a lot, you have experienced a lot. And I'm pulling out actually the witness card. And this is Colette Baron Reads, the mystical shaman. What's the actual, the mystical shaman oracle card. I use them all the time, just kind of go blank. Um, so it's my interpretation that's going with my channeled message, not that of the book and the medicine and the invitations that are in the book. There's a lot that goes with these cards I use them for doing my medicine wheels. Um, and I use it for a lot of different healing. So I feel like for my Taurus that this reading is actually kind of like a, a medicine healing um, for some of my Taurus. I feel as if it's long overdue to be cutting those cords, cutting that, being detached from being in fight or flight brain or just trying to survive. And that as tomorrow on the 19th of September, 2019 starts to come, I feel like some of you have... Um, been able to witness and see so much that now you're witnessing now you're witnessing a new life unfold your true life unfold that's what you're going to be witnessing and a sense that you the hunter and I'm picking up the energy of um, totem animal spirits around us to in this reading and um, of course, I'm picking up the turtle energy. Um, not of course, just because this is Taurus, but because <laughs> um, Taurus and tortoise, right, is kind of what's coming out to me. <laughs> so I'm picking up the tortoise, the tortoise, that the tortoise and the turtle shell. Ninja turtles is what I'm getting. China, it is a, and in the, and I'm picking up something of like in the Chinese astrology. So in the Chinese astrology, it's funny. I'm wearing. A sh I changed my shirt into a little, into my Chinese astrology. This was last year. It's just 2018. So we are really leaving a lot of the past behind, Taurus. Kind of all over. I'm listening to a lot of messages happening here. So Taurus, which is bringing up to remind me to speak about the tortoise energy that's around you today. I feel as if we're coming down to that you don't have to hide anymore you don't have to be you're not being hunted no more whatever happened in 2018 2017 all of that is being left behind it's kind of spit out of your life as the new as one door closes we're on the other side and this feels as if 
you've walked all you've walked all directions you have been on all directions so far in this world and that now it's like and you've lived many lifetimes and it's like now you get to come into the very core center of your heart Taurus and as we're moving to the core center I feel as if we're doing like really core heart center healing umbilical cord connection healing and there's just a sense that the um and being cross that's coming up in all directions this feels like it's a golden opportunity that's coming up for some of my tours to finally feel as if you're kind of able to go out and witness miracles see miracles hunt out the life that you want hunt um be directed and guided and trusting your instincts and just trusting the journey that you're taking because you have walked all directions you have experienced the best of the best, the worst of the worst. You've had to surrender, let go, um, release. You've been able to stand up and speak from the top and say, you know what, this is what I have experienced in life. This is what I have been through. Now we're at the destiny. Now I feel like you're at the destiny. Like you're really starting to move into the direction of how do I want to see my life be as I move forward? What is, what is it that, what is it that the world has for me? But I also am, you know, I can start to, I've gained enough, I've gained enough knowledge, enough education. I've had enough experiences to be able to make some really wise decisions for my life as I move forward. And that's what we have to keep thinking towards is that as you move forward, I feel like you have the opportunity to make some really wise decisions and to be you, to dance in the rain, to live, to find it, to live an exciting, to live an exciting life. And here's, so I have I have the ancient ones that came out for your heart center. And that's what I feel like. It feels if my channel, who channels for me, is a Via uh, strong, powerful woman energy that comes up. Um, I'm Mega Mom First Nation. So, you know, I don't look, you know, I always get, you look too white. <laughs> and you know how those comments go over for me. Um, and so there's just a sense that there's that whole, be who the hell you want to be. Whatever is flowing through your veins, whatever is flowing through your life, that you are here to be like that ninja turtle of your life. Here you're here to fight for yourself. But I'm also picking up the as I'm going back to the Chinese astrology here a little bit. We are in the year of the pig. This is a year of fortune. This is, you know, for so many. Um, this is also a year of just abundance. And this is your you, not all Tauruses are born the year of the pig. You've got to do the every 12 year type of cycle. I'm born in the year of the pig. I'm born in 1971. So every, so go 12 years before that, 12 years after that. But it just feels as if, and I don't know a whole lot about it, but it's coming up in the channel message today to explore not just your uh, astrological, astrological Western sign, but explore your Chinese astrology and also explore your totem. Go in and start exploring totems um, and spirit uh, animal spirit guides. Totems and, and your, your, your animal totem and your animal spirit guide. And this is really the time of like the ancient ones are saying, it's not a time to keep fighting so hard. It's now a time to start dancing, having fun, finding the humor in life, living to your truest self, living as if you're this happy free child who just got set free of being bonded and chained and kind of tied to conditioning beliefs of how to live your life. It's like somebody else as, as a kid, even so much as tells us how we're supposed to dress, what we're supposed to look like, but you're being set free of that. This is now your life to live. It's like you've been all, you've been all circles, all avenues, all parts of life. And you're just starting to find a go pick the direction. You get to pick the direction of your life. You get to be the golden you get to be the golden light. You get to shine. But you're taking off, you're taking off that protection and just saying, I don't need this. I can be very courageous. And um, I'm gonna let the world see me and see who I am. And going towards the sun. It just feels like golden, golden, golden. Everything around a lot of my Taurus energy today feels like golden, golden, golden. And so some of the rooted protection reasons really feels like it's coming from the ancestral level as well as the ancestor being here today, the loved ones being here that's saying, I'm sorry that I did you wrong, or I'm sorry that I didn't teach you what you needed to learn, 
whatever it may be, but I also feel as if we're going into that. Um, whoever kind of left you feeling as if you had to protect yourself in the lower, so in the ancestral level of you, whoever was kind of that not, not always nicest to you or kind of, yeah, just feels like I'm just going to leave it at that. Just not the nicest to you. Kind of left you feeling like a little bit insecure. All of that level of healing is being blessed of and bestowed upon you today. And you're being, uh, you're being given the golden light as if the golden light is shining through you. Um, blessing you with a life that just looks so optimistic, so much more wonderful. And... Um, Just feel free to be whoever you want to be. And I'm going to say this, and and, I'm, and it's like it's coming through and everything is kind of holding back, is being, being, of, being of ascendance of the Aboriginal and also being um, ascendance of white myself, is that, you know, you kind of get, you live, there's so many people out there that are being labeled and we're seeing so much of that racist kind of bull crap and that should that we should never ever have even had to experience because everyone should just be human and we should be allowed to just be considered human but i feel like for some of my tours you are experiencing some of this in your life and what is coming up for me is to stand your ground be proud of who you are stand in your light wear your colors of your of your nationality colors of of your flag your robes your 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 cut you think your um I want, I'm, I'm, I'm seeing a sun dancer is what i'm seeing um i'm seeing like a sun dancer and I, this beautiful woman sun dancing in her sun dancing dress and just like wear all of that so proudly feel never a need to ever kind of hide all aspects of you, all parts of you, all of your, all of your ancestors are all part of making you who you are today. Be proud of it. Walk in your light, but also never be afraid to explore beyond. Look beyond. What else is out there for me? Um, I feel, I don't know why this feels so like such a strong message today for Taurus. I don't usually get this kind of message in a general reading but it just feels as if it is time to stand up and walk your path, your journey, and know that it's okay to have boundaries and to create boundaries and to use your voice and that your voice can be a voice of hope and it's boundaries. And I'm in Mother Mary now, I'm switching over here. In Mother Mary energy and uh, transformation feels like it's taking place as the world is awakening to a world of hope and love and that you are one of the voices of hope and love that's coming out in this world. And it's okay to say, you know what? I need to have some healthy boundaries because that's my care, but I don't need to be guarded and protected and hiding myself from the world. I'm going to come out of my shell. I'm going to open up and I'm going to be all of me. And this is your time, Taurus, to be all of you. Whoever you may be, whatever you may be, allow yourself to be that. Feel no need to ever hide any piece of you ever again. And do look up. Do look up a tortoise or a turtle spirit animal. I don't know where all this is coming from because, I mean, I'm, I work in it to a certain degree, but I don't always, not in such a general thing. Yes, I'm on my phone in the middle of your session. Uh, and I'm really looking this up right in a video because I feel like I need to. And of course I'm reading this from somebody else's website. This is not my meaning. This is what's coming up as I'm looking at. Um,
the mystical message of a turtle totem animal of finding your inner wisdom, the magic of intuition, the symbolic meaning of vast journeys and the gift of, of long life is trusting your inner vision. The turtle is about trusting your inner vision. So it's longevity, blessings, and your journeys. You're about to walk on a new journey. Or you're about to go on your true journey. It's like you're on your, your vision quest. It's like uh, really trusting that, um, have patience. And of course, it really links to protection. But I feel like we're taking off the shell. And so it's like trust that intuition of yours. There's a magical, there's a real magical thing that happens with the turtle energy that it's like the serendipity moments. There's serendipity moments that's coming for some of you, Taurus. This is a long reading, way past my eight to 10 minutes that I try to keep it in. But I feel as if your journey is about to be magical. The healing around you is about to be magical and that you have come full circle tomorrow the 19th. I don't think this video was meant to be ever made before earlier in September. It was meant to be made now. Coming into there, looking into, the, into October, telling you things look like it's a much more golden big healings on the ancestral levels of the past of your childhood traumas or, or situations that were there for some of you feel like there's a healing but many many blessings because this journey now feels like this is right where you need to be walking this is the life you're meant to be walking please enjoy um please enjoy enjoy and embrace every moment of your human experience along with being connected into your spirit self and um, be be true to you be all of you honor your ancestors each and every generation each and every uh, uh, each and every kind of makeup of who made you who you today and be thankful and be uh, be thankful and feel very blessed that you are unique and that you are true to you. Much love and have a wonderful September, end of September and October to all of my Taurus energy that's out there. Much love and don't be afraid to be a ninja turtle. Fight for yourself. <laughs> Stand up for yourself. Much love. Bye-bye.